The beat LFO is kind of a regular LFO, but the LFO speed is tied to the project tempo. So we have here 120 ppm. And when we open up here the help menu, you can read here about the rate. So we have, for instance, here, if we have minus three, we have eight beats. We go to two or minus two. We have two or uh, four beats. Then we get to half a note uh, for minus one. And zero is quarter note. So we basically can step through the divisions. But it's not like an... It's not like an instantaneously switch. You blend between the uh, the divisions. So you can see when we have here in between things, we have partly in there, uh, basically a half note and quarter notes, right? So you blend between the signals, but you can't choose in between speed settings. It's it's like you morph between different divisions. And this is interesting if you need LF, an LFO that's tied to your project speed. It's perfectly in sync with the beat grid. And um, yeah, that's why you use it. And then you have the tilt setting here. And you can change the shape here, of course, from a saw tooth to a reversed saw tooth. Or this is actually a saw and this is a reversed saw. And um, yeah, can also here uh, blend between different curve settings um, if you want that an amount knob. And of course, if you want to switch the LFO to bipolar mode, so you have negative values and positive values and you have an offset. So you can timing offset the LFO to the left or to the right earlier or later on. So besides that, it's just a regular LFO. We also have here the global shuffle setting. So when you have play roof enabled and you dialed in here some kind of shuffle setting, um, this LFO kind of uh, applies the shuffle also to the LFO setting. So we have a, when you have a nice hip hop groove and there's a nice shuffle going on, this LFO basically shuffles with it, which is pretty nice. So maybe apply this here to something like the, uh, the cutoff. And because the speed LFO is always on point or in time or in sync with your project tempo and it's never off, you can use a different LFO for instance, the classic LFO here and modulate just the speed of the speed LFO and you never fail basically uh, in terms of uh, timing. So beat LFO, it's nice.